YouTube what's going on my name is the warrior 925 and today I'm gonna to do a little tutorial with OBS twitch and the Xbox app so recently um, I was streaming with the Elgato and I was having issues with it but luckily I stream from a Windows computer so I'm able to use the Xbox app and there have been issues with for me at least that um, since I want to pick up people's voices um, I have to use the Xbox app and I have to stream the party through there I can't do it through the actual Xbox so I'd have to start a party in the app before I'd hit the start streaming button on the Xbox which I'm sure all of you know and um, it would be really annoying because if uh, I want to invite someone to a party I'd have to stop the stream invite start streaming again and I constantly have to go to this webcam page so people didn't know my business or whatever and see everything I wanted but um, there is a fix for that today and I'm here to show you how to do it so bear with me you're gonna see a lot of crazy stuff because I'm monitor capturing let's make sure I go to the right one okay so this is my setup right here I have my OBS chat um, this is my uh, twitch stream with all my thumbnails or whatever to use and then I have iTunes open and then I also have OBS right here and um, sorry I guess I lost the webcam when I did this um, but so this is what it would look like for you um, if you're doing the uh, Xbox app so you hit stop streaming and it would look like that and you'd go in here to create a party or whatever you wanted to do and then or you could find your friends and you're like okay that's good start stream Whoop, there goes that green ugly ass page okay continue and then I have to minimize mine because I have mine set up like that okay so my friend just gets online and he wants to invite to invite me to a party and he's trying to do it through the console because he doesn't stream alright well that sucks okay I gotta invite him stop streaming then I gotta find him invite him to a party go back all right, he's in the party. Oh, what do you know? His friend wants me to join and he can't invite him. It's just a constant process. But today, everybody, there is the fix. And the fix is there is a new beta app. So it's pretty much like having the same exact app open. It's pretty much the same thing. It's like having two of the same Xbox apps open. And this is what it is right here. Oop the same thing because before there was no pop-out menu for the party chat so um, all you have to do is download this app and then I just shrunk it and brought it over to this screen and now I'm in a party and if I want to go invite more people I can just go to the friends I, um, just so everyone knows um, I just opened this and it crashed on me once or twice it's still in beta um, but yeah this is amazing I don't have to stop my stream to invite anybody I get people get mad at me because I'm not joining their parties or anything like that but this is an amazing, amazing feature. This changed the game for sure now that Xbox is running Windows 10. But yeah, um, you want to download this app? It's called Xbox Beta along with your Xbox app. And that should solve all your problems for party chat and OBS. And I live by the Xbox app. If you have a Windows 10 computer, I would run that. If you guys have any questions on how I set all this up or if you guys also have any questions for um, OBS, I'd be more than happy to help you. Um, I've just started streaming on Twitch uh, with OBS. I was running the Xbox app for a while and it was boring and I like to do overlays and all that such because uh, that way my stream will look like this. Let me give you a peek. If you guys want to follow me, my uh, Twitch name is at uh, the warrior 95 tha and um, so I went from the Xbox app to having now this is what my stream should look like. Let's see. And there it is. Now I can do all this cool stuff. I don't have to constantly do this because this is what you guys would see when I stop streaming. I know it's like where's this game I don't have to do that anymore because now they have this option Xbox beta so I don't have to do it here anymore which is amazing because I was for the longest time I just wanted this to pop out so I could drag it over to my other screen but there was no option to and I think they obviously knew that and uh, now we have the thing so um, let's get back to here Thank you guys for watching. Um, if you could put a thumbs up down there, I'd appreciate it. If you guys have any questions, hit the comment. Don't forget to like the video, please. And uh, my name is TheWarrior925, and I'm signing out. Thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate it. Let me know if there's anything I can do. Peace.